Hey guys, Elpaka77 here and I'm back today with another underrated skill of the week and in this video we're going to be looking at Gabbiadini. So Manolo Gabbiadini is a 73 rated Italian striker. He plays for Bologna in the Serie A. He has 3 star skills and 3 star weaker foot and on the Xbox and PS3 he's been going for about sort of 1k. You can see here some of the prices. I did go and search and looked for all the ones under 2k. And there's a few up. I think the cheapest one was 1k. But him being a non-shiny, most of them probably get discarded. So on the market, he is actually quite rare. But when some do come up, you will eventually be able to pick one up for about 1k. If you're interested in his card stats, you can see them there. He's got 83 pace, 72 dribbling, and 75 heading. Those are his best stats there. So we can take a look at his in-game stats now and he is 6 foot 1, he is left footed and he has 3 star skills and 3 star weaker foot. You may also be interested in the fact that he has got high attacking work rate and low defensive work rate meaning that he pretty much never defends and always stays up front which is really nice. Next are his physical attributes and he has 80 acceleration, 70 agility, 78 jumping, 6, uh, 76 reactions. 87 sprint speed and 78 strength. So 87 sprint speed is really, really nice. His acceleration is a lot lower. Bring his sprint speed up. And for a player that's six foot one, that is really, really nice. His mental attributes are pretty good as well. He's got 80 aggression and 71 attack and positioning, which is quite nice. And lastly are his skill attributes, where he's got 81 ball control, 70 dribbling, 79 finishing, 73 heading accuracy, 75 penalties, 84 shot power, and 77 volleys. So there should be some gameplay on your screens now and this guy was absolutely amazing. I never thought he'd be so good considering he's a non-shiny and he only cost about 1k. Trust me, he is incredible. I'm using him up front as a lone striker in my 4-2-3-1 Serie A silver squad. And Alfaro for me was up front before and he was amazing. But Gabbiadini is even better. He's got absolutely incredible shooting. The 84 shot power I think it is, that's really, really noticeable. His long shots are absolutely crazy. I did score one from pretty much just into the opponent's half. It was an absolutely amazing long shot, which I think I did get recorded, so that's on there, and that will be on the video. His long shots are amazing. They pretty much go in top corner every single time, or just slot nicely into the corner. Shots outside the box, they'll just go in every single time. Finesse shots, they'll also go in. His finishing is 79, and that's really, really nice. What also noticed was his ball control. You don't really notice it on many players, but... For silver players, ball control is a major issue this year. Lots of players, it will just ping off, just go everywhere pretty much. But his 81 ball control was really, really noticeable in game. And he took down plenty of long balls really easily. And didn't really lose the ball much, which was quite surprising. His 78 strength, that's also really noticeable. And accompanied with his 80 aggression, he doesn't get pushed off the ball at all. He pushes so many defenders off. I think there was a goal here where a defender just bounced off of him. And he just an easy, easy finish. And his 87 sprint speed, 80 acceleration as well. That is absolutely amazing for a player that's six foot one. I mean, I was playing one of the matches against Mariapa and Basong, and they're possibly two of the best silver centre backs this year. They're amazingly pacey, and to be honest, most strikers can't get past them. Gabbiadini, it was absolutely easy for him. He outpaced Mariapa and Basong very, very easily. And for a player that's only going for 1k, he is absolutely incredible. So yeah, he is a really, really good underrated silver. And if I were you and you have a Serie A silver squad, I'd go and try him out as I did have Alfaro. But to be honest, I think from now on, I'm going to be using Gabbiadini as 6 foot 1, 78 strength, 84 shot power, 87 sprint speed. That's all you need to know, really. Long shots, just tank people off the ball. And he will score pretty much every single time he goes through on goal. So thanks for watching guys and I hope you enjoyed this underrated two of the week of Manolo Gabbiadini. He's an amazing player, he's such a beast to be honest with incredible shooting and all for only 1k. You may not find one on the market straight away as non shinies mainly get discarded but if you do find one pick him up and try him out. Now, I tried to do this video or this commentary without any notes at all in front of me to help so hopefully it worked out quite well and hopefully I'll try and do this in the future with more of my videos and try and do it without notes. As for my videos the next few weeks, as I did say in my video yesterday, my 3k sub special, that FIFA was pissing me off and it really is pissing me off. But I do have enough gameplay to do reviews on M. Lapper, Giovanni Sio, Wallison, Michael Liete, Dos Santos and Marquinho, players like that. I can do reviews on them without actually playing the game as I've got enough gameplay sorted out and on my hard drive. I can also do 
squad builders like my Russian Premier League squad builder or Bundesliga squad builder, maybe even my championship squad builder. And I've also got gameplay for another few underrated silver weeks. So I can still create videos while playing Black Ops for maybe the next few weeks. As I think a break from FIFA 13 might be the good thing, a good thing to do as it really, as I said, is pissing me off. But I can still bring up videos and I may do a double upload today as I did say that I'd try and start doing videos every Wednesday when the Team of the Week comes out and pretty much show you the in-game stats of every single player in the Team of the Week and then talk you through which silvers to look out for, which silvers to buy and which ones I'll be buying and may possibly review. So thanks for watching guys. If you're interested in that, let me know in the comments section below and I'll probably do that. As usual, if there's any silvers that you think are underrated and want me to try out, then let me know and I'll try them out as well. Previous videos will be on your screen now and thanks for watching guys. Cheers.